everybody. Dot bets. Check them back in with the NFL Week Six on the dot NFL pick 'em with the Random Again on Sports Empire. Uh, if you followed along last week, uh, we won some serious cash. Uh, we went five and zero with plus twelve units. Hell, you might have parlayed one and uh, won one big. Uh, so if you did, show some uh, love. Hit that subscribe button like this video uh, maybe even give me a comment below show me some pay stubs uh, everything like that uh, we'll look to build on it this week in our uh, week six on the dot pick them before we dive into our picks uh, go ahead and sign up for on that Vigit app we've been talking about tweeting about uh, our code rng20 gets you 1000 free coins uh, it's the first ever social network betting app talk to anybody about any pick uh, comment on anybody's pick they give you free coins for commenting uh, it's very very engaging very easy for those uh, maybe beginning betters out there that don't want to get their feet wet with real money uh, also you know you can win your girlfriend your wife your fiance $25 gift cards all the way up to $100 Amazon gift cards you know I know my wife's obsessed with uh, Amazon so Heck, I've tried to win her a couple here and there. Uh, so, you know, go ahead and surprise your girl. We recap of week five of the On The Dot picks. Uh, we went our clean sweep, 5-0, and oh, plus 12 units. Uh, we cashed our Cardinals, our big bet, minus, uh, minus six and a half for three units. Cashed that easily. Called a double-digit victory. They won 30-10. to 10. It was a blowout. Uh, also won the over in the 49ers-Dolphins game. I think it was over 50 and a half. Uh, that thing... The Dolphins almost scored it themselves, uh, so we were we were really really on the dot there. Uh, and then we had our teaser, which snuck by, you know, a little bit of crazy with uh, Seahawks coming back at the last second. And then you got Dak going down. Didn't know if the Cowboys would cover, and the Eagles made it a little bit interesting against the Steelers. So uh, luckily we hit all that. And then we had our Browns, our dog pick, go ahead and uh, dominate the Colts that game. Uh, I think it was 27 to 10 at one point. Uh, made it a little bit little bit closer at the end uh, but like we said man uh, we went 5-0 and plus 12 units uh, couldn't have couldn't have had any any better success there uh, so that brings our overall record uh, to 19 14 and 1 for plus 15.39 units uh, for our NFL season so far so definitely definitely have had some success uh, looking to build on that with these coming up picks. enough about last week uh, we're on to this week everybody's screaming at their TVs or phone screens or computer cameras telling me hey Go ahead and send those damn picks out. Uh, so here we go. We got the Lions minus three, our first pick for two units. Uh, I think Lions coming off a bye here against at I mean at Jacksonville. You got Galladay to Stafford all day long. I know there's a backfield misery of Swift, AP, and uh, well, it's Carry On Johnson. He's kind of irrelevant now. Uh, but yeah, I, I think they're gonna. Pretty much handled the handle the Jags. Jags haven't played that many good opponents. Lions have actually had a pretty dang tough schedule. Um, and road favorites coming off a bye. Uh, good stat I saw. They were 62 and 28 um, against the spread, uh, or I think it was straight up. Uh, but either way, great number to see. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna take Lions minus three for two. For our second pick, we're gonna go the Giants against the Washington Football Team over 43 for two units uh, before I hear the booze coming through the screen uh, I have been on an under train uh, this whole week uh, but I got a couple more overs that I like as well in the NFL uh, but this number is way too low um, I I think it's a little bit overreaction to the uh, to the benching of or not benching but of Kyle Allen not coming into the second half of the Rams game and the Smith I think they got like seven total yards in the whole second half it was, it was a disaster uh, it was raining that game uh, a little the, the uh, Washington football team can move the football with Antonio Gibson and McLaurin and Kyle Allen can uh, he's an agile quarterback so I think they're going to put up points against the Giants the Giants also have a good enough um, offense to put up points against the defense of uh, of Washington. Um, so another good stat I saw as well: winless home favorites are 40 and 22 and on the over. Uh, so that's another uh, positive stat for us. So definitely going to uh, key in on this game. All right, our third pick. We're going to go with the Eagles Ravens over 47 and a half for two units. 
I was stunned when this number came in under 50. Um, I know that there's going to be no receiver, receivers for the Eagles, but uh, Travis Fulgham and you got uh, Greg Ward. You still have Zach Ertz. You got Miles Sanders. I know it's a good defense of the Ravens. I just think this number is too low right here in this situation that the Ravens can put up points. They they also they don't they got Lamar Jackson. He hasn't been Lamar of late, uh, but I'm thinking this is a get right game for him uh, and put up some good points. Deep balls to Marquise Brown. Uh, Andrews gets his touchdowns like always. And who knows what's going to happen in their backfield. So they might just have to throw it the entire time. Uh, but I honestly think that the Eagles and Ravens are going to put up some uh, big points here. I, I was stunned when this wasn't under uh, was under 50. Um, and definitely going to you know put two units on this. And uh, go ahead and cash. Right. And our last pick, well, our dog pick of the week. Uh, we've been cashing on these a little bit. We're going to go Bears money line plus 100. Uh, I think it was started at plus three. It actually went down to plus one. Uh, but I'm just going to take the money line here at plus 100. Uh, they've come off two tough opponents defensively, the Colts and the Bucks, uh, And now they get a little bit easier matchup with the Carolina Panthers. So you can run, you can pass, um, you can do anything on this defense. Uh, Nick Foles, uh, definitely going to put up some points here with a Rob with Anthony Miller Darnell Mooney I believe is another option for him uh, you got David Montgomery in the backfield Panthers also have a very very nice offense I think this game stays close but I got the Bears winning by a field goal. Personally, we don't have a survivor pool pick for you uh, I'll give you one but I'm, I'm no longer in it uh, so we got last week we got lo- we lost on our 49ers who looked lost on the football field uh, I'm not bitter about it at all. Uh, but uh, this week, I'll uh, go ahead and give you the Dolphins against the Jets. Uh, should manhandle them, get you guys an easy win uh, to advance. Um, so go ahead, like this video, hit that subscribe button below, a comment if you are tailing any of these plays, if you like any of them, if you don't like them, let me hear what your thoughts are. Uh, so let's go ahead and get another sweep. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.